Cat 2 and briefly 3, Tropical Cyclone Omar gave us a bit of wind but no rain as she passed by twice while out in the Coral Sea. Well, nice day out here on the river, on board Anakam. This is Thursday the 21st of February. Just been getting a few things ready in preparation just in case our little friend out there on the Pacific called Cyclone Omer decides to head this way. I unload the last dinghy load of provisions. Getting Anacam ready just in case I have to move out and seek shelter for a few days. This was one of the early forecasts that said we were going to be hit here in Bundaberg. I'm not sure whether this is going to work, but I'm just trying to line over the solar panels to make sure they don't pass company. I've tied the boom down. I've locked the mainsail in. So it cannot physically unfurl. I'll actually open it. No, I have. Got extra wraps on the headsail. Tied off the furling line. And just to be sure, to be sure, I have a small strop where I've tied around the headsail to stop it from unfurling. The next lot of forecast tracks were all over the place. Well, the breeze is just starting to build. Here it is Friday morning. It's about 7.30. And we've got 15 to 20 knots here already over at Double Island Point. They've got gusts to 48. Omar has gone from a Category 2 now a Category 3. We have a king tide, right? a lot of storm surge pushing the water up even higher. Lucky Rescue just went up river to help the boat out of the sea level. I bet you it's not the last they have to do either. Back to a Category 2, but all over the place again. Certainly blowing at about 30 knots at the moment. The computer-driven weather models cannot agree where this thing is going. Just to let you know, we have our mantas well set in the riverbed. We have a scope of 12 to 1, 3 8 chain all the way on a very heavy snubber. And the boat is riding beautifully. We're in a bit of a calm between the gusts as that's Bundy Rescue going past, back down to home base after helping out a yacht in distress. Our very own Bureau of Meteorology has now got involved as it is now in our area of responsibility and they all forecast that it's going to turn and head back north passing us very close. It wasn't long after that last forecast and the wind speed really picked up. And the very 
very next forecast, they change the direction of it altogether. I don't know whether you can hear this, but it's blowing at about 25 to 30 knots here at the moment. It's been doing that for hours. All coming from the south southeast, coming off the back of what's probably X. Tropical Cyclone Oma. It's moved further out to sea and left us with the wind and no rain. You heard right in that last clip. It is now X Tropical Cyclone Oma, but now we have the extra strong winds coming in from the south southeast of the high pressure that's pushing it away. We have some clouds building on the horizon. Let's hope they bring the much needed rain that we desperately need in this part of the world. And by the looks of this weather chart, it doesn't look like the wind is going to abate any time soon. Those clouds we're looking at on the horizon are bringing a few little skippy showers, but believe it or not, they're out in Harvey Bay.